Hey guys, this is Harshal and you are watching everything cracked. So this is my new Ryzen setup, Ryzen 7 2700. Uh, in past I had an i3 system, which was 4 Gen i3. So this was the system and <coughs> this was micro ATX form, 12 GB of RAM and i3 4150 was the processor. So now I updated to Ryzen 7 2700. And this is the setup you can see here. Uh, I upgraded the motherboard, RAM, and the processor. Uh, I have same graphics card which is GTX 950. And I was wondering if I could directly update from Intel to Ryzen AMD. So, what I did was just uh, updated the parts and directly connected to my SSD. So, you must be thinking, how will it boot, right? But the thing is, it booted right into Windows 10 and just took a few tweaks for the Windows which uh, it did automatically and it booted into Windows 10 and this is the result. So I started GTA 5 here just to check everything is fine and yes, you can just put the SSD and system will be running. You don't have to do anything else because uh, Windows 10 has already drivers, basic drivers in it. So I guess it is fine to directly update the system without doing a fresh install but uh, I recommend doing a fresh install because of the compatibility issues or some cache memory that will be remaining so you can do it but this is the point that you can update the system directly without updating the Windows 10 OS so thank you for watching and do subscribe